It is kind of funny when they have floor time because I guess because it's not their house they need to establish their dominance and I find sometimes um, Sammy doesn't um, doesn't let Finny have everything I guess like in their cage Finny is definitely boss um, but out of their cage uh, see Finn is kind of rumble strutting and everything to tell Sam those are his places, but Finney is more following Sam than the other way around. Oh, leave him alone, Finney. He knows your boss. And I've actually had to take that tunnel away a few times on them because they both love it so much they were getting in fights over it. Hi, baby. Hi, so nice to see you. Mr. Bossy Pants. Hi, Sam. if he likes the hay box. Oh, Phineas. Little brat. I don't know, they've run over that green thing a few times, but nobody's snuggled on it yet. Yeah, you stay out of my work at close. Again, on top of the fish and not inside the fish. So, I had someone a few months ago comment on uh, one of my guinea pig videos um, about how they thought that I was a guinea pig or a rabbit lover, not a um, guinea pig lover. And uh, just to clarify, I love absolutely all animals. So the majority of my channel is devoted, of course, to my rabbits um, and my website, which is budgetbunny.ca. But um, I absolutely adore all animals. I have um, 13 or 14 animals. What are you doing, Sam? Be nosy. Hi, Phineas. Um, so most of the videos will be about the rabbits, of course, but occasionally there's going to be other videos, and I honestly just find these guys so entertaining to, um, watch. <laughs> like, what's not entertaining about that? I love it. So I just find them so entertaining to watch, and um, like he wants to get in there so badly. So they're fun to film, I think, and they're fun to watch. And you know, if I have another video I want to share, no matter what kind of what animal it is, I I would hope that you guys would like to watch it too. Look, Finny's got half his head in there. See, this is how you know they're friends, because Finny wants to be the boss, but he'll try to mount Sammy, and then he'll popcorn. Or he'll rumble strut, and then he'll popcorn. That's how you know they're friends. He's, he's not really being serious. He wants Sam to know that he is the boss, but... <sighs> Hello, mister! But other than that, it's normal piggy behavior, happy piggy behavior. 
I have to actually say that I saw this really sweet piggy last night, and he's, um, I believe he's Abyssinian Lake, my two. Um, probably a little smaller, or about the same size as Sam. And I just loved him. I wanted to bring him home. But I was so scared because, um, these guys get along so well. I don't want to jeopardize that. I don't want to, um, I don't want to break them up. And I'm kind of scared. I know some people, like, Piggy Pig Pig's trio worked. Um, but other people are saying for males that pairs work better. Um, and I'd just be so scared that one of them would get bullied around because there'd be two to gang up on them. Whereas with these guys, they can kind of banter back and forth, I guess. Um, so as much as I'd love more, I think it's going to have to stay with these two. They're so cute. And I love them to death. I do. I love you guys so much. Hey, babies. Um, the other thing is, too, I wouldn't be able... I have no more room to make a cage larger for them or to put them in a different room. We have kind of certain designated animal rooms, and they're in... They're in the pet room, I guess you'd call it. It's where my bunny's in the piggies are, and uh, there's absolutely no room to make their cage larger. It's a 2 by 5 which I know they say is big enough for three piggies, but sometimes I don't even feel like once you get all the stuff in there, it's big enough for two. Jeez, this is going to be a long video. I think I might split it into two. I don't usually talk this much, but I don't know. You guys probably don't want to listen to me. <laughs> I'll just let you watch the piggies for a bit. Oh, he is popping on that green thing. One thing I've noticed with piggies, they love to play in bundles of hay. Oh, found a good one. Nom, 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 nom. Hi, piggies. Hello. Aww. I don't know how long Sam's hair is going to get. Do Abyssinians, does anyone know? Do Abyssinians, um, does their hair get to different lengths? Or does it all grow really long like Finney's? Sam's hair doesn't really look, I guess it's gotten longer. I don't actually know how old Finney is. I think he's pretty young still. Um, but what actually happened is, yes, I did get him at a pet store. However, um, I know the people there pretty well because I'm in there all the time buying supplies. And what happened was they had someone actually um, drop off in a box in the middle of winter um, six guinea pigs. And they were all, there were a couple little ones, but they were all mostly about Finney's size, um, and I'm hoping they dropped them off in the morning right before the store opened, but, uh, so they were for sale there, and of course the little ones went really quickly, and, um, but yeah, so they don't know how old Finney is. I just assume he's young, because he's so, I could be wrong, but what I've read anyways is that younger guinea pigs are much more, um, active and bouncy and I mean he's definitely he's definitely full of energy um but I mean I haven't noticed that Finney has grown any since I got him maybe just a little bit but Sam is like doubled in size Finney don't be bossy Oh, it's getting dark out there now. It's so nice, though, this on... Oh. <laughs> oh, look at that fuzzy butt. Look at that fuzzy butt. Oh, I see a little piggy bum. I 
pretty little piggy bum. <laughs> oh my goodness, what silly piggies. Anyways, what I was saying was it was so nice on, um, he's gone in there somewhere. Where is that Sammy? Where'd he go, Finn? Where is he? Where'd he go? Where's your little monkey gone? Hey, where's your monkey? Do you hear him? Okay, so for the third time, I get distracted easily, sorry. Um, it was so nice that we changed the clocks, moved them ahead an hour here on Sunday, so that we get an hour more of daylight at night. So it's just been wonderful, and all this week, it's been really warm, like nice warm spring weather, and sunny, pretty much. We had awful thunderstorms last night, but um, nice and sunny and warm, and... More sunshine after work makes you happy. I might even get them out this weekend outside. Set up a pen for them. Hi guys. Hello. We can see them so much for today. It's probably all that hay. I hope you're not getting sick, buddy. But I don't know if you can see that. They're huddled in there together snuggling. So I guess they've decided that it's uh, it's to be shared. They certainly fought over it enough. So, Oh, Finny's all snuggled up. Maybe I can get him on the other side there for you before I go. Oh, he was all snuggled up. I know. Mom's being a pest, isn't she? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, little munchkins. Anyways, yeah, so sorry if these were such boring, long videos, but I just thought it was so nice and sunny, and I wanted you guys to see the new toys that I got them all, and they're just so cute. So, next couple of videos, promise, will be about the bunnies, and I am planning on doing one that is um, kind of like a meet and greet all the pets uh, so that you can meet all our wonderful animals because I just love them all so, so much. Bye!